Step 7. Cutting out windows. For this part, you will need a knife for cutting out the windows. I'm going to use the scalpel. You'll also need the skewer that is in your pack. If you like to work precisely with straight lines, then you're welcome to use a ruler or you can also cut freehand. You will need the template from step 4 and your house facade. Firstly, lay the template over the house facade and line it up. Now use the skewer to go over the lines to transfer the design onto your house facade. For the purposes of the demonstration, I'm just going to do the door. You should be able to see now that there is an indent where you pressed. Next, use the skewer to make a circular hole in each corner. Don't push just straight down, twirl the skewer as you work until it goes all the way through to the material underneath. When working with clay, when you have intersecting lines, particularly at a sharp angle, they sometimes develop cracks there. This method of making a circular hole should stop that from happening. Next, cut from the edge of one circle to the edge of the other. When you're cutting, it works best if you're able to kind of score a little bit at a time. So, score the line, not all the way through, then score in the same place again, and then score again. As you can see, I'm being quite careful not to cut beyond the circle. Score from the edge of the circle to the edge of the other one and then go deeper on the second pass and deeper again until you can feel the tip of the scalpel touching the material underneath. As you can see, I'm working with the clay supported on the board. Try to avoid picking it up at this stage. The less you handle it, the better. And also remember that this is not precision work. You are not a machine. This is a handmade object. Here I'm going through just checking that all the corners have been cut into. It's easier to cut from the circle. You can see it's moving now. To remove it, stick your skewer and stick your knife into it and pull it out. Continue working on cutting out all the other windows and in the next video I'm going to show you how to make these lines a little bit nicer and um, eh, get rid of some of the some of the burrs. Okay, see you then.